goes out to 20 minutes. Get him out. Finally, I got to swap around. back in shove your insulation back in there and your little lock lock okay let's carry that now next step, I'm gonna get a ball back in there. Like I said earlier, really make sure you put the or get your socket and everything back together first. And then you'll be able to get this slide back in there. Oh, I gotta quit pushing on that fan. LEDs, LED lights have fans. I don't know why they did that, but they did. Right. I'll see a high. That ball is going to go high and low now. Plus, I got to tighten. I got to align all this up tonight. It's going to need like a quarter. No, I actually have a light, a light alignment. while I'm at it, but I'm not going to change my ball mount, but let's see what else is I just used on that. Use the flat slider. Two thousand of these things, huh? Hey, you even, you even got one that looks like a freaking bottle opener, huh? <laughs> okay. All right, so here we are. Okay, so with that said, everything's in. Everything's hooked up. Hmm. It's gonna be interesting trying to change that bulb out with the adjusters in the way. Ah, shoot! All right, just so you get a clear view of what I had to do. So there we go. All right, as you look down there, you can see the see the adjusters now. You can see my hole in there, four by four, and of course that's where the where your turn signal is in the front so now these are these are your those there are your adjusters you're going to adjust adjust it where you can where your height is going to be up and down so you get it where you want it Ooh, it bounces up and down a little bit doesn't it hmm Hmm. 
see what it looks like when it goes down the road, huh? Okay, so that's where we're at. So, come out tonight, we'll do an alignment on it. Let's see how it, see how it looks. I'll pull that off so you can see. All right. Put the hood down. Let's get an idea what it looks like at the moment. The side looks, lines up pretty well, I guess. So we'll have to see what it looks like in the dark. Right now, what I'm gonna do is I'll change the polarity on those, uh, those, this other set of bulbs here, and then uh, we'll go from there. This is a continuation of upgrading the uh, headlights uh, with the bulbs in this case. Well, they said to in my email back from uh, the dealer or the dealer that sent them to me, it says you need to change the polarity, which means I got to go in here. And I gotta swap the green and black with the red and blue. So I gotta put this one on this side. And he says that that'll work. I'm like, well, great. Why should I have to do that? But anyway, I can either get my money back or go ahead and do it. So um, I did that on that side, and I'm gonna go ahead and do it on this side. So um, I spent thirty dollars on uh, pin pin puller kit and uh what you got to do pull the um pull a little blue rubber seal back a little bit pull that red locking um sheath out of there and then go ahead and use the pins to uh pop those out all right after fighting with it for about a half hour finally got them swapped out so fortunately i had to cut back Cut back on the insulation here so I can get the wires I need to be. So the next thing to do is just get this rubber back in there. Kind of hard with one hand. We'll go back in. Okay, got that done. Now, like I said, squeeze this plate, lock plate back in there. And you're all done. All right, well, see what happens come tonight. See if we ch have a change in uh, change in polarity, high at night and low on the morning. But anyway, okay, we'll have to see what happens tonight. But uh, there you go. It's giving you a uh, example of original, <laughs> the original and the and the. Uh, the cobra cobra headlight look okay continuation here um, I just installed these um, on the uh, left left side um, it does does give you indication left and right so uh, I've already done the right side as you saw in that other video um, pretty simple just don't try and tighten too tight on the screws because they will strip out in that plastic um, and then again on this side on, on this again um, because of the way the turn signal is set up straight in straight out um, you're going to have problems getting that plug installed um, unless you uh, cut that cut that out. So you may not want to do that. I don't know. Uh, but uh, it does not say anything <laughs> anything in here about cutting cutting out that uh, cutting out. All it shows is you know remove that turn signal nut. And then it'll pull that out, and then you can disconnect that that plug, and then uh, you do the same same with that. You know, push those little uh, little pins in there, and you should be able to slide it, slide it out. Uh, in my case, unfortunately, I fiberglass those in place, <laughs> and then you got uh, and then. Uh, 
Then once you turn right around, once you cut that headlight out, go ahead and turn right around. Um, connect your corner bulb into the one piece, but it will not clear that uh, that assembly in there. It just won't. So, and then push it all, push it all back in. It looks really cool, right? Um, and that uh, shows right there how uh, I just installed those um, those adjusters. They're all adjusters, is basically what they are. Um, so, and then uh, of course, at the end, at the end or at the top, it says, "If you experience any difficulties." that the instructions did not cover, please seek assistance from your local automotive shop. <laughs> and uh, let's see, tools required, quarter inch drive ratchet, 10 milli, milli socket, and needle nose, needle nose pliers. Um, but it did not tell you you're gonna need like a quarter inch um, socket um, to, uh, I think it's even smaller than that to a, to you to uh, do the adjusters. So, because on the end here they're um, they're like hex, um, like an Allen Allen tip. So I have a I have a special tool that I bought when I was in the field that uh, actually adjusts headlight uh, those headlight screws. So anyway, stay in tune. Um, I'll put this one up anyway, and uh, when I finish side, um, I'll, I'll be back with a follow-up on this. Um, actually, I'm going to do a follow-up tonight uh, when I do adjust that one, one headlight. We'll see how they, how that, uh, how they look, um, especially when I did the change the polarity um, in the uh, LED headlights. All righty, here we are. And how right uh, to my to your right as you're looking at it, how uh, how flush and black out that is. And on this side, how uh, straight on it is. Um, so it looks pretty good. Um, what I need to do. Okay, now I'm gonna adjust this. Now, when I was in the field. I picked up this, it's a headlight adjustment. You're gonna have to do a lot of this on the road. Ok, 
get out a little bit more, more than that. Uh, more. I'm going to drive it to work. And, uh, get, that, get those adjusted. Uh, they said I had to go in there and change polarity. So this is low. And that's high. Low. Let light completely out. That's what has to be done for, for that. Push high. All right. There we go. Takes care of that. Finally. Unfortunately, I still got to do this side. <laughs> All right. So, here we go. We got light. We got LED light. We got updated lenses. So. Yeah, you me what you think. So you catch me on the next Dave Cosby's Project Stang.